So now we've got Silent Hill. And I have been looking forward to this one. Okay, start and select. So presuming I can press select on this and it won't quit. Hopefully. But I've been looking forward to playing this demo because I don't think I've ever actually played it. Because I have played another demo that came with Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, well, we can't figure that because it's Silent Hill. <laughs> if you have played PT, you'll know what to expect pretty much in terms of that. I was got of that, like, negative as well. Uh, is this going to stay on the screen? or Because I'm, like, I'm pressing the buttons and it's not doing anything. So I don't know, maybe I've got to unplug the controller for no reason. Let's try that. Oh. I think it's loading, actually. <laughs> it seems to be loading really slowly, which is not a good sign. What the hell is up with this? Is something up with the disc? Don't tell me someone's up with the disc. Because I've really been... This is like the one game on here that I've really been looking forward to playing. Because it's like... I'm not familiar with this. Or well, actually, maybe this is just part of the horror. Just the fact that I can't actually load the game. <laughs> and then all of a sudden... Aah! Or something like that. Just like... Like a, like a ghoul just pops out of the Konami logo. Actually, I've just realised the Konami logo... It kind of looks like... Two bacon rashes. Oh no, I've just, I've only just noticed that. I don't get why they changed it though, because like the old Konami logo is just it's really cool looking, and then it's like the one they've got now is just lame. You know, it's, it's just Konami in like some vague shape thing. It's just yeah, kind of sucks. It's like bring back the classic logo. God damn it, it looks so much cooler. I remember they had like an even older one though, it said like Kionami or something. At least that's what it looked like. I get the film this is not in fact, you know, I'm gonna No, I can't press it on select, so it doesn't seem to work. And yeah, turn off the analog doesn't seem to help either. You know what? I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. And yeah, I kinda have to take a little bit of a break there. So let's try this again. Hopefully it actually works this time. Because I've really this is like the one game I've really been wanting to play, like I said. I mean, because I know Silent Hill anyway. Like, I've, you know, I have the full game. Although, honestly, I've never actually played the sequels. Okay, this seems to be working now. Yeah, okay. I don't get what... I don't get, like, what wasn't working before. But, yeah, I do have this game. But I've never played any of the sequels. I never played... Well, anything after the original. Oh, okay, intro. I'm... Probably gonna have to, uh. I'm probably gonna have to replace the intro actually, because you know, it's Konami. <laughs> you know what they're like. I mean, if you've, um. Yeah, if you've seen me play the Metal Gear Solid demo and I beat it, and it's like. I had to skip all the cutscenes. That really sucks. Woo! By the way, if, um. If by chance I do have to replace the video, I'm just gonna put Dwayne on there. Because, you know. Yeah, to, to get us in that, you know, horror spirit. Or, you know, Halloween spirit. Because, you know, no one can drive like he can. Yes. Because you can do the monster mash. Yeah, here we go. Eventually, we'll get into the actual game. You know, you know one thing I've just remembered with this, is they never included a playable version of this on the Euro demos until, like, I think it was on Demo 103, and that was it. And yeah. I mean, the CGI, I don't know. It might have been cool 999, but it does look a bit dated nowadays, I think. Oh no, that's just me, I guess. You know, it's kind of funny. I mean, <laughs> Metal Gear Solid's cutscenes have aged better. And it's like, like that game didn't even have, like, FMV cutscenes or anything like that, so. It's pretty cool looking, though. Or, you know, the intro itself is pretty cool. Janet! <laughs> yeah, okay, I don't know what the hell I'm doing at this point. I try to think... Actually, I I do wonder, like, what demos I should do, like, next month. Because I've got one demo in mind that I want to do, but... The rest of the stuff, I, I haven't really made up my mind. Like, because I want to do some French demos, I want to do some German demos. 
I want to do some essential PlayStation demos, and I want to do like maybe some other demos that I haven't bothered to do yet. Yeah, you know, miscellaneous ones, I guess. Okay, and that's it. So now we catch it again to the game. So let's just stop. Actually, I probably should check the options to see if they're very different to like the full game, but whatever. So is this just going to be like the start of the game, or I'm not sure. No, okay, this is like the school. So let's. Which way should I go? Actually, should I go forward or? In fact, let me let me check something here. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. It's the torch. I forgot the controls already. This is going well. Okay, here, yeah, this is what I wanted to do. Okay, handgun, handgun bullets. I've got plenty of bullets, actually. Uh, kitchen knife. Uh, I don't know why I got that, but whatever. A pipe. The torch. Pocket radio. Yeah, that's quite helpful. And if you've played the game, you'll know why. It just, you know, makes a noise whenever there's an enemy nearby. That's it. Enemies around here, in fact. Oh, okay. Okay, they're dead. Hmm, should I go in there actually? I'm not sure. So let's check around here. It's kind of weird the way the, like, the light moves around when you do. Oh no, so anyway, it just looks kind of off. I mean, it's obviously like a, P a limitation of the PS1 and not, you know, an effect of the, you know, what the game is trying to go for. So I can't go through there. Oh, bugger. No, let me run. Okay, I need some space right here. Oh, okay, so he died pretty quickly. Oh, okay, I think, yeah, I shot them and then they got up. Okay, I see. So I'm trying to think. I'm, I'm just sort of... Yeah, because I think there was something in the, the corner earlier. I want to see what that does, if anything. So what's this? A silver moon. The moon. I'm guessing, do I need that to open this door? Or. Yeah, okay. The hands are stopped at 10. Okay. So is it not 10 pm? I mean, obviously, it can't be 10 am, otherwise, it wouldn't be this dark, but. Okay, and I don't think you can open this door, can you? No, okay. I think it's just. Yeah, you go in here. And you read this. It's written in blood. Now can be the laboratory. Golden in old man's palm. The future hidden in his fist. Exchange for sage's water. Gold. Old man's palm. Exchange. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. So I'm guessing later on I'll probably find like an arm and I gotta like get some water off him, maybe. So I don't think I can go over there because the chair's in the way. I don't get why he doesn't just move it, but what are you going to do? I'd like to move it, move it. <laughs> uh, yeah, dredge up all <laughs> horrible memories of the past right there. If anyone's old enough to remember that song, I know I am, unfortunately. So there's no enemies around here, I don't think. Oh, okay, give me that. I do want those bullets. I don't think, I don't think there's anything else to do with them. No, I can't go through there. But I don't think there's anything else to do around here. Because I, I don't think checking the radio is going to do anything. But yeah, I know this is like the school area. So, so I just kind of remember this. Okay, you can't check that. So let's go. Ooh, I don't like the way the camera's working. Okay. You can do this, which is quite helpful. Um, so can I go in here? No. I promise I don't remember where to go, or really what to do. <laughs> I, I want to see if I can at least beat this though, because I haven't really, I haven't played this on anything else. Oh, but uh, actually, I think I remember what to do. You kick his head in. Oh, and I think I died. Or what the hell? Yeah. 
Yeah, I didn't see anything from beyond. So you know what, let's keep this guy in two. Because I think if we do that, they, they like stay dead. So what's my condition? Uh, yellow. Modest, yeah. Let's just use that. Okay. I'll be more careful, I promise. I need the camera to cooperate though. Alright, stop. Calibrate and listen. I don't get, like, why am I making so many references like really awful 90s songs? Maybe this is what the Halloween does to you. I don't know. So I can hear some noise. Oh, I want them bullets. Ooh, go with them noises. Honestly, I probably should have turned the light off for this. Maybe it would have got a reaction, although... Considering that this is PS1 graphics we're talking about, maybe not. Okay, there's no enemies in here. Okay, can't do anything with that. Okay, is there anything else you can do in this room? Because, I mean, I've got some bullets and I think that's it. Nothing useful in the desk drawer. Nothing useful in the desk drawer. It's huh, great lyrics right there. Nothing useful in the desk drawer! Nothing useful in the desk drawer! Yeah. <laughs> Actually, that's still better than most of the lyrics <laughs> that you get in the boy band songs, but what are you gonna do? <laughs> okay, I don't think. No, can't go through there. So let's go down here and think. Is there an enemy around here? Or. I would not be surprised. Okay, so let's go in here. Okay. Apparently we can't. Can't get in there. A friend in need. Okay, well I can't actually read it. I just know it's a friend in need. Because it's about to get devoured by some zombies. No, I, I jest, of course, but... Appears to be broken. Oh, red light. You think they fix the electricity around here? Yes, I do want to press the switch. What does this button do? Yeah. Promise I'm not the best person to get into the Halloween move. Okay. So, yeah. I know you gotta do something with this. I'm not entirely sure what, though. Okay, so let's just go. Let's go up here. Kind of funny how to salute each bit. It, it almost reminds me of Half Life, actually. Wait, does it? Except you know, Half Life, it just says load in, and then he just immediately pops it with the next bit of the game. So, you know, let's be careful. So, I don't want to get attacked again, and I get the feeling there's some more enemies up in here. Oh! Oh! What the hell? <laughs> oh, yeah. You got these, like, weird, like, ghost kids, and they just, like, walk around and make weird noises. So, let's go down here. Okay. Oh, well, you're about to die, son. And just a kick, for good measure. Yeah. You deserve it, boy. Thankfully, the enemies stay dead when you kill them. Which is, oh, wait, I don't want that. I hear some noises right here. No running in the... Well, let's say no running in the... I can't actually read it. No running in the halls. Is there any markers or anything useful in them? Nothing useful in them. Great. Nothing useful in the locker. Okay. Maybe... The, I probably haven't bothered to check the right one. Maybe I'll check the one at the corner. Okay, well, apparently there's nothing in here. I'm probably missing whatever it is. It's probably just some bullets. And if we're looking at how many bullets I've got, actually. I mean, look at this. 42 bullets, plus the 12 that's actually in the gun. Oof. Oh, bugger. Okay. Yeah, eat that. Okay, I can't even check these. Hopefully this place isn't too big. Okay, so I think we're done with this area. Unless I have to go back to that room. 
but I don't think I do. Uh, okay, there's no room there. Except the way it came, but... Oh, I can hear ya. Now, no, there's gotta be another enemy. Yeah. Shoot you too. No, I don't want to shoot you. It's a waste of ammo. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a real good strategy to turn the light off. Let's walk around in complete darkness. Let's go from this thing has infinite battery. Well, maybe it just... I don't know. Maybe it's so not powered, but... I don't think that'll really help much around here, considering how dark it is. Okay, can't go from there. So let's just go over here. There's gonna be more enemies around here. Well, we've got the ghost kids again. They sound like dogs, actually. Almost. Like, like, I don't know, chihuahuas, maybe? Uh, can I go in here? No. Yeah. Someone's up with the pipes in this place. And they said it was a pipe dream. Oh, great. Now I can... In fact, you know what? I'm going to go back the other way, because I want to see what those other rooms are. Okay. So I can't actually go into those, so that was pointless. Oh! Do this. Okay. And oh wait, no, I don't want the camera like that. I need to be able to see your head. No other enemies around here. Uh wait, did I miss the door actually? No. Okay. Just checking. No running in the halls, but yeah. I can barely see what I'm doing around here. Oh wait, there's a hand. I think yeah. Maybe I need some water. But I'll take the bullets. Have I got any water actually? Or whatever it was I needed, I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it's none of these things though. So let's see, we've got. Yeah, we've got the Statue of Norman's hand, the Fisher Tires have never to let go. Yeah, I think I do need something for that. Because otherwise, they wouldn't put that clue there. Then again, it wouldn't be the first time Konami have you know, lied to the players just to trick them. <laughs> I want to play Castlevania 2. Okay, I can tell you right now that the way the characters talk, that was not just bad translation, believe me. <laughs> I've read about it. So, I don't think there's any enemies in here. Um, nothing helpful. Oh, wait, bottle of water. What the hell? There's still water, no reason to take it. Okay, did you, was you not paying attention to the riddle? I don't think he was. Nothing helpful. Let me check here, actually. Nothing useful on the shelf. Okay, nothing there. Uh, look at this. There's a chemical, take it? Okay. I thought you would have had to use, like, the distilled water, though. But I guess not. Actually, is that a shotgun? No, okay, that's just some scenery, I guess. But let's at least try the chemical on the hand, see if that, like, I don't know, dissolves it or something. So I think I need this. I think I need to use this on that door that was at the beginning. Uh, can I use... Let me check this. Use, let's see if this works. I think it worked. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take that. So I think... Hopefully... Ho oh, what the hell? I don't know where the hell he came from. Maybe maybe one of the doors like has opened. Maybe I can go through here now. No. Okay, I don't know where the hell that came from. That was good. Oh. That was strange. I really need to pay more 
care going through this place, considering all the undead midgets that are trying to kill me. Wait, okay, I didn't miss a door. Although I can't open it anyway, so who really cares? Okay, thought I heard some crack on there for a second, but nope. Okay. So now let's try going back to that bit at the beginning. See if I can, uh... I'll see if I can get some over this. Because I want to see if I can beat this. Oh. The enemies all come back to life or something? It's a good thing I got all those bullets. I'm guess the enemies are going to be, going to be a lot out here too. Maybe not. Uh, try that. A golden sun. Let's see if this works, because it's definitely circular. A golden sun. Heh, <laughs> there's another game. Which, I, I never actually played Golden Sun, I don't know if it's any good. I know it's like a GBA game or something. I mean, I don't have many GBA games, to be honest. Oh, wait, I think... Nice, I actually got somewhere. So, let's see. So, we climb down the ladder. Oh, okay, there's more. But looks things. Let's look this way. She told me to look this way. Talk this way. <laughs> yeah. I'm in DMC and Aerosmith classic. Actual classic song. Actual good song. As opposed to uh, the songs I was quoting earlier. <laughs> so at least I'm going up in the world. Wait, is that it? Or... I'm going to have to do something else. Where am I? This is not going to end well, is it? Have I been here before? <laughs> well, that really awful TV show. <laughs> Which had like Charles Ingram talking about how he's like an Egyptian woman or something. <laughs> oh no, I never actually watched it. I just remember like watching Charlie Brooker like criticize it. Cause Charlie Brooker is awesome. Okay, so what the hell's going on right now? Oof. Well, you can tell it's getting intense because that music. Actually, I'm gonna show you. Is it the same doors that were open? Find it soon enough, I guess. You can tell us it's starting to get. It's getting intense on that music. Dun! Oh, okay, so I can go through that door now. Oh, I see you. Oh, you bugger! Run! Run! Okay. Okay, we need to kick these to make sure they don't get back up. That music's gone, but I don't know what to do now. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Uh, this place looks a lot more screwed up than it was before. I mean, <laughs> this place hasn't been decorated in like 50 years. Someone called Gok Wan. <laughs> Actually, I forget. Is Gok Wan decorated? I don't remember. I don't really care either. Oh, wait, no, this looks like. The area I was in before, except now it's like slightly different because the yeah lock just jammed. Okay, I don't get why I can't yeah can't you just shoot the lock? I mean I don't think you can. But yeah, see what I can do around here. Lock's jammed as well. Okay, I can't go through here. It's almost like I'm in the dark world, like this is like dark seed or something. But let's go up here. Actually, you know what this place reminds me of? It reminds me of like. It reminds me of like Birmingham. <laughs> it's just. Because it's just run down. Well, okay, actually, yeah, to be fair, this place isn't quite that run down, but still. So I can hear a school bell. Actually, where's this? Health drink, I'll take that. Uh, actually, do I need that? Because I know I've got hit over now. No, it looks a bit alright. Let's carry on. Carry on. 
as if nothing really matters. Yeah. <laughs> I had the feeling this one was going to take a while. Unless, I don't know, maybe there's a time limit that's about to go off. Where the hell am I supposed to go now? I have no idea. Dun, dun, dun. Let's try that. And this. Okay. Oh, well we got that music again, which gives me a feeling I'm going in the right direction. Or maybe I'm about to die. It won the two. Do, do. Yeah. <laughs> they really need to get a bad music teacher in the school. You know what I'm saying? So, it always sounds like... <laughs> it always sounds like they got Ray to be the musical teacher. It just... Yeah. Which is a mistake. Just having to go whir over the song. Oh. There's definitely some memories around here. Oh. I see you. Oh, great, now it's freedom. No! Okay, I'm not getting killed by you. Actually, you know what, I'm going to do it this way. If I die, I'll, um, I'll quit the game, because this is going on for quite a bit. But at the same time, I do want to see if I can beat this. Okay. So there's no other enemies around here, I think. I mean, you can tell this is like... almost like a Dark World version of the school. Oh, wait, there's some bullets right there. I'm taking those. Yes, even in the dark world, you can just find bullets in the middle of nowhere. Actually, I guess that probably makes more sense in the dark world, but... I say dark world, I mean, really isn't, but... Oh, no, I'm just saying it because it just... This just reminds me of, um... Yeah, Dark Seed. That's what this is reminding me of. But I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Um... Yeah, this is really helping. Is it just here, I think? Because I don't think you, you can go to the left or right. That's all beep right there. Uh, I don't know why I'm doing that. I need to like, walk up to actually see anything. See, this is when they need to fix the electricity around here. But I think I'm on the roof right now. So, Actually, I don't get like why he doesn't just check this in the middle of the day. But I suppose, you know. The game would kind of lose its horror value if they did that. Yes. I, I live among the creatures of the night. But, okay, I don't think there's anything to do around here. Unless maybe you can go... No, you can't go down there. And I don't think I can interact with anything here, so it's just... So this whole area is basically pointless. Or... Well, Okay, well, there's some bodies. But they will never hit the floor because they're tied up. Oh, wait. A valve. Strange valve, nothing unusual. I would try shooting it, but I don't think that would actually do anything. Ooh, actually. This is where you check stuff twice. Yeah, you don't miss anything. Um. Okay. So let's try going a different way now. Seeing as I've Explored this as much as I can. <laughs> okay. Hopefully most of the other places are locked, so I won't have to spend too much time exploring this area. Okay. So let's go through here. Actually, it, it does feel kind of funny, like, playing a Silent Hill demo right now. Because, you know, Silent Hill's in the works. And... Oh, okay, I can go this way. But yeah, like I was saying, like, Sun Hills is in the works, and, you know, a lot of people, yeah, they were going all hyped about the, uh, the PT demo. Well, I say demo, it was like a, well, it was what the name was really, you know, playable teaser. But apparently it doesn't really have anything to do with the game. So, I think if I walk into that, I'll die. <laughs> But at the same time, I'm not really sure what else to do. I think there's got to be some way to switch it off and then go through it. But maybe I'll go the other way. Because that way just leads back to where I came. Oh, wait, no, there's a door here. Okay, so we've got here. Okay. I, 
Oh, wait, what the hell? No! Okay, I just saw that. Okay. Can I not shoot these? Okay, I think I might be buggered right here. Okay, there's nothing here. I think that I think this is just a way to get me killed, really, so I could bother with that. Uh, my health is yellow. Uh so let's see if that works. Okay, that works well enough. So let's go this way now. I should wish I did miss I want to check just because I could have sworn there was another door around here that I just missed because it kind of blended in with the background. Yeah, okay. Let me guess this is going to be the same, isn't it? Oh, if not. What the hell's this? Okay, apparently this is nothing because I can't do anything with it. There's a rubber ball. Oh, that's weird. And there's this other stuff that I can't do anything with. There's a doll, but I don't think I can do anything with that. But the doll hit the floor. Oh, wait. Was... Can I crawl in there? Okay, I don't know why I keep pressing circle. There's really no point. Ah, okay. I should have checked this before, really. Secondary school. Uh, elementary school. <laughs> B, okay. Ball room, the storage. Um... Yeah. Look at this. Yeah, it's like they're tired actually. It's like it's like ten PM right now. I wasn't expecting it to take this long to play this actually. What am I missing? Honestly, I should have checked this earlier really. But see the hole. Well that just gets me killed. Um let's see. Perception infirmary classroom. Teacher's room. Up. Oh, I like the film. Okay, I'm not sure what to do here. Because I don't have any clues on which to go by, I don't think. Unless, um, maybe the doll is a clue and I just haven't figured it out. Also, there's less rooms than I thought there were. Oh, okay, I can't go for there anyway. Um. Can I go to the other way, actually? I want to check. Just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Like, if I... If I can... No. So I'm pretty much restricted to, the, to those few rooms. In fact, let me check the second floor just to see if I'm missing anything there. Let's see. Um, never quit room, chemistry lab, I reserve. Maybe we're supposed to go in the music room. I mean, you got that weird sound in the background. Although, I get the feeling I'm probably not going to be able to go through that. Yeah, because I think all the, like, squiggly lines, they say, like, where you can't go. So, let's see. So, I'm going to go in the hall. Oh! Actually, no, I just figured it out. I think I can... There's, like, two doors in that hall. Where's any just word trying to kill me? So, I think i got to go through that other door. So it seems like I can go through there. Trying to get killed, but oh, okay, I can't go for that. Bugger. Uh, okay. In that case, I have no idea what to do here. Um, because I don't remember, and I haven't got a clue. So let's see. Uh, where can I actually go to? So let's see. We can go to. We can go to the classroom. The the classroom on the top left. Um. Library, library reserve. Maybe I'll, maybe I gotta go there. So let's try going on the second floor. So let's try this. See if, cause I what like I said, I really want to beat this. It would be cool. So I think the library is the one at the end. Oh, I can't open this one. I guess it's one that looks like you can open it. But I guess not. Oh, I, I, okay, I just figured it out. Okay, if it's red, that means you can't open it. I thought it was just like if it was squiggly, you can't open it, but... Okay, never mind that. Oh, wait, yeah. Okay, I can go in the large, which is just... 
Okay, I see now. I see. I was kind of missing it before. Oh, I can't go in here? It's too dark to look at the map here. Yeah, it's because I pressed the circle by accident. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, so, I get it now. Yeah, the only thing I can go into is the classroom then. Which, I don't think that actually helps at all. So I remember credit, it's just a bunch of chairs and nothing else. So it's like, yeah. What's the point in that? Hopefully the enemies are dead this time. Yeah, like, you look here, it's... Oh, wait, there's a ladder. But I can't seem to do anything with it. Oh, wait, no, they're not ladders, they're just shelves, I guess. Let's just what the hell's up with this. <laughs> like, it's just a bunch of chairs, and, like, that's, like... That's it. Um, I know I can't go in here, because... Yeah. I think I'm stuck. Because I don't really know what to do. I mean, if you look at the roof, I mean, that. yeah, that's all that's up there. And I can't really go anywhere else. I mean, yeah, you look here. Because the only place I can go to are the storage, the, that other room. That didn't really seem to have anything. Uh, the hall... And the courtyard. That like that's it. That's all I can go to. So yeah, I'll try that valve again. If I can't Oh, okay, I can't open that either. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay. I was looking at the wrong door. But, you know, I'll try the valve again. I'll try to see if I could do something up the roof. If I can't figure it out, then I'm just gonna quit. Unless maybe I'm missing something here. But I don't think I am. Like, you just see a bunch of chairs and that's it. Yeah, not much to say there. So if you go through here, seriously, they're all decorated this place anyway. Um, so I don't get this. Are these are these bodies like powering this water tower, whatever it is? I mean, it kind of looks like a water tower to me, but yeah, because it won't let me do anything with this unless I'm supposed to use something with it. Maybe a steel pipe. Wait, I don't want to do that. Reload, actually, let's do that. Let's see. Um, what can I use? Rubber ball. What happens if I try using that? Okay, I can't. Pocket radio, flashlight, or torch, or whatever. Yeah, I, I don't think... Yeah, I can't really figure out what to do here. So, you know what? I'm just going to... Quit. If someone could tell me what I was supposed to do there, that would be nice, but yeah. Uh, we're done with that. That took <laughs> damn that took quite a while. But we've only got one game left, which is Soul Reaver. And again, I think this one might take a while. So yeah. Actually, one thing that I remember is if I remember correctly you have to skip the intro, which is annoying. Because I know it's got like match content. So I'm gonna do that. Because this video is running on quite long anyway, so. Yeah, Eidos. Now, Soul Reaver is a really cool game, actually. I mean, it's made by Crystal Dynamics, who made sort of like the later Team Ready games. I need to get around to playing those at some point. I mean, I remember mentioning that I want to get t the Team Ready reboot, but. Yeah. Blood Doom, like, I don't get that. Why does it say, like, Blood Doom? Because you, like, Blood Doom isn't really anywhere in this. And that game was from, like, 1996. But, yeah, we're going to skip that, because I know it's going to be, like, match content. So let's start this. I don't quite remember what to do in this. I know I've played this demo before. What is on the options? Oh, okay, it's just that stuff. Okay, let's just do this. We serve some centuries after his execution. Vazil is galvanized by hunger for revenge and the first of a new kind. Not for the blood of humans, but for the vampire's apostate souls. Okay. As Vazil, you must discover and cast the first of many powerful glyph spells. The fire glyph. To gain the fire glyph, you must complete the following tasks. Discover an unlit torch. Light the torch on the only available source of fire. Discover a great statue and offer the fire up to him. Use your newfound glyph spell for the first time. So I'm trying to process that. I gotta find a torch, and then I gotta light the torch. 
Actually, no, I've seen a video of someone beating the stomach before. I seem to remember it being kind of... We're not really being obvious on how to do it. I think it's like you have to throw the torch somewhere. And yeah, as you can see, pretty complex controls. Which is cool. Because this game's cool anyway. And as you see there, the impale move is like the most important move in the game. Or one of the most important moves. Because you pretty much have to use it to kill the enemies. And yeah, circle to the various souls, which kind of gives you extra health, if I remember. So that's... Oh, is it loading? Okay. So let's start this. Well, it decides to load. <laughs> My computer is heating up just at the prospect of this game. Oh. Yeah, you can actually attack enemies with just about anything you can pick up, really. Which is quite cool. I like that. But uh, I don't think I really want to use this. Yeah. I don't think there's any items in them, so... Yeah, X to swim. Uh, where is it that I'm looking for? Okay. So let me click this. Wait, no, there's nothing there. Uh, yeah, this is it. See, it just kind of like gravitates towards him, which is cool. I like that. And then L plus... Yeah, L1 plus X to high jump, which... It is quite an important move, actually. I'm going to put this over to the side, because I want to show this off. So I think there's an enemy down here, if I remember correctly. What's this? Kaboom! Look at that. And we dip out with the soul. Yeah. You also notice, like, that, that Dreamcast logo on the bottom. I mean, I know it's not really a Dreamcast logo, it just looks like it to me. Except, you know, it's green instead of blue, but what are you going to do? Oh, you bugger. I've got it to block, though. <laughs> yes. Oh, like that. Yeah, like I said, this is a really cool game. I like this. I don't remember... Oh, okay, yeah, you open that. And I think... Yeah, I think you need the torch with this bit, actually. I don't see any enemies... Well, maybe there are enemies down here. I don't... I promise, I don't remember. But I just remember, like, actually beating this demo is, like... It's kind of hard to figure out from what I remember. Yeah, it's one of those things. So, I might not be able to beat this demo either, to be honest, but we'll see. So we're just going to put that there. Because I need the torch. Yeah. I find it almost feels kind of funny that they call it a torch. Considering that. like, Because I'm pretty sure Chris Lannan and are American aren't they? I'm pretty sure they are. I mean they, they made some really cool games for PS1 actually. Like like they made the Gex games. This game obviously. Of course they also made Soul Reaver 2 for PS2. Um, and there were some other Legacy like, of Kane games. Which I've never actually played. Like Blood Omen, I don't actually have Blood Omen, I never actually played it. I might play it at some point, it, it almost kind of looks like, I don't know, Diablo, I guess. But I think, if I remember correctly, I think you have to do like, you have to throw it. I don't remember what to do after this. I think you can climb this guy, yeah? Unless I'm remembering wrong, I don't remember. It's like that. Problem is, I don't remember how to climb properly in this. Um, but I'm trying to. F problem is, I'm trying to remember like what I'm supposed to do here. Because you got this ladder. Yeah, you just grabbed onto it automatically. So I don't think I'm climbing the pillars or anything. So I'm trying to see what am I meant to do? Because I this this is the part that I can't actually figure out. You also notice, like, your health sort of gradually depletes as well. So you got to watch out for that. But I don't remember how to do this bit. Because I know I'm missing something. It's just I don't remember what. Is it... If you got to activate this, maybe? See, the problem is... I don't remember. 
but I'm sure you gotta activate this somehow. Maybe I've gotta use that stick actually. Or whatever <laughs> whatever you want to call it, I guess. It might have something to do with that, but the problem is I don't quite remember. So let me grab that. And See, promise if I press triangle, he just throws it uh, straight at the wall. I can't even see where it, where it hit. Okay, what the hell? Okay. Camera went kind of weird there. Oh, wait, no, I see it. Because I don't know what to do. I was thinking maybe select. But I guess I found select my quick demo. In fact, let's try that actually. Oh wait, select brings up that. I'm not sure if that helps though. Press select button. Oh what the hell? No, give me my weapon back. Oh wait, okay, I think I've done it. Problem is, now I need to kill this thing. Give me that. No, I. I want the... Okay, I guess I can't get it while I'm in this mode. Just gonna have to kill up my fists. No! You're taking me up like that. Yeah, eat that. Okay. So I think... Yeah, okay, I think I've just done it. Now we gotta do this... Oh, wait, let me take that. I see it. So, this bit might be a bit hard though. So you gotta do all this platforming. I mean, maybe I could just. Ah, actually, not. I'm gonna try that actually. I'm gonna try to do. <laughs> oh! Can you not go on the ladder when you're when you're in this mode? I guess not, because it's not laying me. Right. What's that? Yeah, I got the power. I got all the power in the world. I gotta say, this part is harder to control actually than it is um, just playing normally. So it's making me miss these jumps with that and the camera just reset there. Okay, I don't want to face that way. I want to. Oh, bugger. <laughs> this is just, this is just gonna be like the whole play, me playing this game, just like mess up with jumps constantly. Ooh, and I ran off. Great. So this is the problem. When you're in this mode, it's hard to actually pull off the jumps. So let me try this again. Get the camera positioned. Okay. Okay, I think I've got this down. Ooh, close one. It, it almost sounds like fireworks going off. It's kind of funny, because in that, you know, in a few days it's going to be bonfire night. And if the camera could stop turning on its own, that would be nice. Okay, let's better not mess this up right now. Okay, and I don't want to run. Okay, there's a reason I'm like tapping very lightly on the, uh, what I say tapping, moving very lightly on the uh, stick. Because I know I'm going to mess it up if I don't. So let's do this. So, ah, okay, here is the, here is the torch. So now we've got to light this up. Gonna ladder it up. I don't know what the hell I'm doing this. Considering that I'm just gonna go on the ladder anyway. Now, if, I think you gotta go to like the the idol guy, <laughs> whatever his name is. So maybe I'll go through here. I think the fire stays on forever, but maybe this time limit. Hopefully not, because that would be kind of annoying. But now we gotta go to the next bit. Actually, I don't remember. Do you need something for that next bit? Let's check. Because I think... I don't think it's... I don't think it's this door. Maybe it is. I, I know it's like another gate, but maybe you have to go there at the end. So we've got a stick. Oh. 
No one can stop me. Nothing can stop me now. Actually, it's this. Yeah, okay. Go run. We have to run. Yeah, because I've always does that. You gotta do like several times, I think, in order to actually. Oh, don't want to do that. Actually, can you kill these things with the this with the torch? I'm not sure. That's true. Okay, I don't remember what to do here. Oh, actually, no, I think I do know, actually. The problem is, you got these idiots getting in my way. Which really doesn't help. I don't get why they put enemies in this section. It just seems kind of, like, weird. So, I promise you gotta get the timing down. I don't remember when you're supposed to throw it, which is the problem. Because do you have to throw it when you're on this ledge, or do you have to throw it, like, on those steps? I don't know. No, I don't want to do that. I want to... I want to throw the stupid... I think it's because these stupid enemies are here, which is why it's not letting me do it. So, you know what? Let me kill these enemies first, and then I'll do it. Yeah. So you can go die. Oh, bugger. Okay. Okay, and I... Why did you pick up the torch? I did not want to pick up the torch. This is... Ugh. Yo, oh, sod it. I'm not gonna bother. Uh, yeah. For that, I'm just going to quit, because I can't be bothered to do all that again. So yeah, we're done with that. Um, <laughs> yeah, random still. Okay, I don't really get that. But yeah, we're done with the best horror games ever. Yeah, that took quite a while, didn't it? Oh, don't tell me it's crashed. But actually, it doesn't really matter, because I'm done with the demo anyway, so who really cares. But yeah, um... It's a pretty cool disc, although some of the games, I don't really think they fit on a compilation like this. I mean, Silent Hill and Soul Reaver, those are definitely, like, the standout games on this, I would say. Because the Resident Evil video sucked. And, like, the Carmageddon video. I mean, the Carmageddon video was quite cool, it's just the game sucked. And, okay, it's going back to the menu. Actually, I may as well talk about the games while I'm here. Yeah, Death Trap Dungeon's alright, but it doesn't really fit on here, I don't think. Dino Crisis, I'm not really a big fan of it personally. At least what I've played of it. And the demo is lame, because if you press square, it just quits. I'm not going to bother playing it now, because the video is already like nearly two hours long. Doom is really cool. Um, but it's not as good as the PC version. Exhumed is really cool. And, yeah, like I said, Resident Evil video sucks. Nightmare Creatures is alright. Quake 2 is alright. Call Me Again. The video is alright, but the game sucks on PS1. And, yeah, these two, like I said, are the standard games. So, anyway, I will see you later, people. See you.